osteosarcoma. All you, your family, and your friends need to know about osteosarcoma. What is cancer? Cancer happens when some cells in your body get sick and go a little crazy. These crazy cancer cells can cause problems because they do not act properly. Normal cells grow, reproduce new cells, carry out their jobs, and eventually die like they are supposed to. Cancer cells don't do these things properly. Cells contain instructions called DNA in their nucleus, and when these instructions are mutated or changed, they can become cancer cells. When your mom or dad gives you an instruction, like, please go and tidy your room, put away your laundry, and make your bed, you can do the work because you understand what they are asking of you. But if your parents said, please go room to laundry and bed away tidy, you would probably be confused and not know what to do. Well, that is how it is with cancerous cells. When the instructions in the DNA have a mutation, the cell does not know what to do, and so starts acting strangely. You remember how we said normal cells grow, make a certain number of new cells, and then die? Well, in cancer cells, when the instructions get mixed up, the cell has trouble doing those normal things. Cancer cells make way too many new cells, all of which are as sick as they are, and cancer cells don't die when they are supposed to. You can see in these pictures how normal cells work and then how cancer cells go a little wonky. Osteosarcoma is when cells in or on your bone become cancerous, have mutated DNA instructions. Osteosarcoma is a type of bone cancer. This kind of cancer is common in children, so the doctors and nurses specialized with bone cancer know how to take care of little children. Osteosarcoma usually happens on the bones of your legs or arms, though it can grow on other bones. Your body is an amazing creation, and it has specialized systems to keep you alive and healthy. When your body realizes that something is not right, like cancer growing on a bone, the body starts reacting to the cancer. When the doctor uses the word symptoms, they basically mean signs of a disease or cancer. There are a number of symptoms or signs for osteosarcoma. Here are some of them. Very bad pain in your bones, especially at bedtime and nighttime. Being very tired all the time, even if you got a lot of sleep. Losing weight and getting skinnier. Swelling or a lump and warmth on the limb near the cancer. Sometimes the bone with the cancer on it will break suddenly and unexpectedly. Inflammation, soreness, and sometimes a fever are also symptoms. These are normal reactions of the body. You do not need to be afraid of them, though you do need to get help if you have them. The body acts this way because the cancer is hurting the body, and the body is trying to fight the cancer. There are three stages of osteosarcoma. In the first stage, the cancer cells stay on the bone where they started. This is the best stage to find out about the cancer, since the doctors can treat it most easily. The second stage is where the cancer cells start spreading to other parts of your body. This is called metastasis. The final stage is where the cancer keeps coming back, even after it has been treated. Cancer can sometimes be frightening, but there are ways to stop the cancer from spreading or making you sicker. The doctors are there to help you. They want you to feel better. For osteosarcoma, surgery is the best option for making you better. The doctor can take out the cancer on the bone, which sometimes includes the whole bone as well, in which case you might get a whole new leg or arm. These are called prosthetic limbs, and they can be a lot of fun. Look at all these kids in the pictures who have their own special arms or legs. Chemotherapy is when drugs are used to kill cancer cells. This is used before and after the surgery 
just to make sure that all the cancer cells have been properly destroyed. Sometimes doctors also use radiotherapy to finish killing off cancer. Radiotherapy is the use of radiation to kill the cells. Cancer can be scary, but you need to know that people care about you and are going to work hard to help you get better.